Tell us about the Black Sheep as well. The Black Sheep um, is a hostel that I that I opened uh, when I moved back home. I bought a building and renovated it and opened up Black Sheep um, almost six years ago to the day. Mm-hmm. Um, 40 beds, tried to be an eco-adventure hostel. So, mm-hmm. you know, there's a veggie garden out the back. We've got chickens and ducks out the back. Um, at the moment, there's a really good crew. Internationals working there. Um, and then two years ago when the pandemic hit, the hostel was closed. It looked like it been closed for a while. So... A cheeky little move to move a coffee machine we had inside, move that out to the lane, uh, just to serve coffee to people because there was no place to get good coffee. Everything was shut at the start of the pandemic. Yeah. And um, lucky enough, it's it's gone from strength to strength. So now they're they're kind of two businesses. Mm-hmm. Uh, and they they kind of they kind of work together quite well. I think we do we do good coffee. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. There's a good there's a good vibe down there, good staff. So it's a, it's a nice little business. Yeah, I love it. Uh, that's actually where we spent a lot of time because. Uh, during the pandemic, you, you, as you said, you couldn't go anywhere. So we basically went for coffees there yeah. almost every day, yeah. you know, and uh, coffee was really delicious. Um, so I'm from cinnamon buns. cinnamon buns as well. Yeah. And uh, now you have the Snickers bar, yeah, the, yeah, the yeah. healthier version of that's also delicious. Um, but yeah, in Croatia, we have a really strong coffee culture. People usually after work, during work, before work, they would get like five coffees per day. Okay. We just sit down and chat, you know, that's like what we do. And we get a lot more sunshine. So every bar, has a, like a big terrace and mostly people sit outside you know and it's like a in a street like this you would have like a bunch of cafes and you could like go from one to the other just meeting people you know and uh yeah, it, it, it's a great crack but um what was i trying to say with it yeah um so um not a lot of people go into like really trying out different coffees they usually find a place where they go for one coffee all the time and yeah. the one that i showed you it's kind of the best seller in croatia most people drink it and drink um black coffee at home where they cook it like that or the bar stuff that you get you know like from the machine yeah but i noticed that you're trying out different coffees and um you know like uh, sorry that you have different flavors of coffee yeah yeah so we we, we change up the bean every now and again yeah mm-hmm. yeah yeah i suppose you know you got the coffee belt and some some coffees taste chocolatey or some are fruitier or like african coffees are stronger or, i don't know i think in croatia you like a darker roast as well so like yeah. here's probably ireland's probably more of a medium medium roast a lot of people have their coffees with milk here in ireland mm-hmm. uh, so yeah we're just we, we just we just play around with a kind of thing give, yeah. give people variety and see what people like mm. and it's interesting it's fun yeah, yeah definitely you're always learning yeah, yeah. And, and you uh, I, I love to try out stuff you know yeah. and then when you when you come like two months later you're like oh man this is completely new yeah, like, yeah. so i like that part um do you have a favorite type of coffee or i like the south american coffees mm-hmm. yeah 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 but then every now and again a good a good coffee from africa is is, is quite a first day it's like oh what's going on here i don't like it but then you're like oh yeah that's 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 quite tasty mm-hmm. kind of thing we like we every 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 month or two we get one from ethiopia or something mm-hmm. like that so it's nice to try or i have like as i said we have the um, the the aeropress machine at mm-hmm. home so that makes good americano so mm-hmm. we generally mm-hmm. have an african bean at home and uh just make that like americanos yeah. that in the morning it's mm-hmm. nice yeah a lot of italians like americanos like that or espresso just like straight yeah um in Croatia also a lot of coffee with milk you know like yeah. most people drink it in in cafes like that yeah but hey to each his own you know yeah, like yeah. some people like it like some people can handle milk like uh I know that my girlfriend is not really good with milk so she usually takes uh, with just a little milk or, or without at all yeah. so yeah. the milk alternatives are getting quite popular mm, as well yeah. like we sell a lot of oat milk now mm, yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely and it tastes almost the same you yeah. know so yeah it's a bit it's sweeter fun. but it's nice yeah yeah it's good yeah. and i sometimes do like it a little bit sweeter you know like most people don't put any sugar in the coffee i, I like it sometimes but yeah. I, I can do both you know like depends on the on the mood and uh how you're feeling but yeah um have you uh, got a, like a coffee ritual like uh wake up in the morning and do like a coffee when you take a book and read or is it more like on the go like I'm when, when you go. get it yeah yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah if i'm gonna be, yeah i generally wait till i get to the hostel to have my coffee because it mm-hmm. just gives because they're either flat white so the, the steamer the machine does the steam quite well uh, but if i'm at home then yeah i'll have americano at mm-hmm. home but generally i get up at breakfast on the go kind of thing mm-hmm. i was cool. only yeah it would be nice to be relaxed enough to read a book in the morning, but it's like, there's always too much to be done. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And you seem like the let's go and do it type, yeah, you know, yeah, so yeah. 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 Cool. Yeah. Hey, thanks for watching this video. If you want to see the full version, go to the Uncle Gold Podcast YouTube channel or watch the next clip.